There are different ways to sum rows and columns in Microsoft Excel. So the method I'm going to show you today is the easiest and fastest way you can do your auto sum in Microsoft Excel. So we have the names of people who bought these items. We have the item, item one to item six. So if you want to get the sum of the total items for item one, all I need to do is to click on where I want my answer to appear. Now I want the answer to appear under total. So click on total, then go to home. Under home, you go to editing. Then you see this symbol, this symbol indicates sum. Click on it. Once you click on it, it's going to select all the values for item one, which is sum C3 to C9. This is C3 and this is C9. So once you've done that, you're going to click on enter on your keyboard. Once you click on enter on your keyboard, you can see the answer, the total for item one appears here. So once you've done that, all you need to do is to click on this. You can see do that for each and every one of the items, or you just come over here. You can see this small uh, box here. You double click on it. You double click on it, or you just drag it to the right to or to fill other uh, items. So this is how you can do your colon sum in in the easiest and fastest way. So the same thing applies to the row. You can come over here. I want to get the sum for this, for how much Samantha has spent uh, in that particular shop. All I need to do is click on the cell where I want the answer to appear. Then you go over to home, go to auto sum, click on this symbol. Once you click on the symbol, you click on enter on your keyboard and the answer appears here. Then you come over here and click on this small box, double click on it. Once you double click on this, you're going to see the total values appears here immediately. So this is how you do it and this is how you get the auto sum for it. So this is if the sum for the rows and this is the sum for the columns. So once you're through with that, okay, another thing is that if you want to get the sum of maybe the first to the third item, all you need to do is to come over here, you click on sum, you click on equals to sum, you click on equals to sum, you select from this item to this item, that is item one to item three, then you stop, you close the parentheses, and you click on enter on your keyboard, you're going to see, you see that you have just three, 1606 out of the five uh, six items so this is basically how you can do your auto sum the quicker the fastest way so if you enjoyed this video please kindly give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel thank you